civil rights activist Amelia Boynton Robinson uh, passed away today, August 27th, 2016, at the age of 104. Boynton Robinson was among those beaten during the march across the Edmund Pettus Bridge in Selma, Alabama, in March 1965, uh, the day that later became known as Bloody Sunday. State troopers tear gassed and club marchers as they tried to cross the bridge. Um, it was actually depicted pretty well in the movie. A uh, newspaper photo um, featuring an unconscious Boynton Robinson drew wide attention to the movement. According to friends, she was a loving person, very supportive, uh, but civil rights was her life. 50 years after Bloody Sunday, uh, President Barack Obama um, held her hand as she was pushed across the bridge in a wheelchair during a commemor uh, commemoration of that day. Uh, according to President Obama, she was as strong, as hopeful, and as indomitable of spirit as quintessentially American as I'm sure she was that day 50 years ago. To honor the legacy of an American hero like Amelia Boynton requires only that we follow her example, that all of us fight to protect everyone's right to vote. She was hospitalized in July, apparently after a stroke. She turned 104 on August 18th, and this morning she died approximately 2.20 a.m.